Hey there, YouTubers. Thanks for tuning back in. This is Dan Strong with Excel VBA is Fun, and I want to talk to you a little bit about Google Drive, Google Docs that you can do. I'm on my Google account right now, and I just clicked the Drive button. I, you know, just like you can click here for your email or here for your YouTube channel. Click on the Drive button. You will be amazed. Uh, I want to talk to you about creating a form, and then, uh, of all things, I want you to fill out the form that I'm actually making on this video, because I want to take a little bit of a poll, um, a couple questions that I've been wanting to know of what would, where my energy and focus needs to be directed for these videos. So I want your feedback. And anyway, and then you can create your own forms that pe you can have other people fill, whether it's for your business or for personal, for a church function, whatever. That's pretty cool. So uh, let's just use a sample form here. This is exp espresso looks pretty cool. So we'll say Excel. Oh, if I could type, Excel VBA is fun. Question. Questions. Okay. I was going to spell a questionnaire, but I didn't want to take forever. Okay, so all you have to do, you can put your form description here. Um, quiz for you. You can put more of a description. Question number one. Um, what's more... Uh, let's see. And this is, this is a real um, question I have for you. What's more important um, in that... Let's see, more videos slash content or having um, well edited slash, you know, zoom and pan videos. Because it, it does take me a while to go through and edit the videos, you know, zoom in here and zoom out there. Uh, I don't. I want to know if that's really important to you. If it is, I'll keep doing that. But I tell you, it takes. Um, so, you know, I get a limited amount of time to focus on making videos each week. So I kind of want to know. You know, what's you want to have more content that's just kind of square and you know not so zoomed in and and nice HD format, or would you rather have you know for me to take my time, which is fine. I'll be happy to do that. So just let me know. Um, and then let's see this is a multiple choice you could have text questions where they can type in their answers or even a paragraph style you can have them choose from a list or check boxes pretty standard here um, so let's go ahead and have a multiple choice and then I'll actually rephrase that question in option one we'll put more videos slash content or and then uh, the other one will say Having ooh, Let's see, Control A, select all, delete. Having well edited, zoom pan videos. That's the main question I wanted to ask. Let me see if I can think of anything else. Well, I got you here. We can click on Add Item. Let's go ahead and test a scale question. I don't know why. From one to five. Let's see. Uh, why? <laughs> why not? How helpful are the uh, ActiveX? No, no, no. Let's see. No, I don't want to do that. I, uh, let's see. Um, let's change it from scale to uh, one. Uh, choose from a list. Uh, what's the most helpful series? And I'll list a few here. Uh, I'll pause so I can list. Okay, so we got user form series, tips and tricks series, basic series, the ActiveX and worksheet buttons and controls series. So what's the most helpful series? And you could even check this out. Choose from a list, but there's a go-to page based on answer. I've never done that before, but you could have it continue to a different page, or if they clicked a certain button you could have that submit from there instead of going on through the rest the rest of it so maybe if you had a somebody who's ready to buy now if you're selling something or a house or something so anyway that's kind of cool uh, let's make these all required questions if you would be so kind as to go ahead and take this quiz I'll give you the link in the description of this video and I would certainly appreciate it um, 
No world happened to that other question. Oh, here we go. Here it is. Whoops. Yeah, this is the drop down um, menu. I'll put one more question on here. Um, and this is the confirmation message you're going to receive. It's going to say your response has been recorded. Uh, I'm going to customize this. You are awesome. So, uh, you can publish the results. You can allow responders to edit responses after submitting. Let's do one more item. I want to do a paragraph text instead of just a, a text. I'm going to say um, any helpful comments, suggestions, ideas that would make this channel even better. And I want you to please think about that and uh, give me an answer to that. I will give you the link to this. Um, I'm going to click on <coughs> click on send form here. So there's a link to share. I will actually send that to everybody though. I'm not going to send it right now, but I <coughs> I'm going to click on see right here you can change the theme. Right here you see that there's no responses yet because I just made it. You can view the live form. So let's view that. Hey, that's pretty snazzy, right? This is what it looks like when you're filling it out. So my favorite is this one and I this is more important to me and here's my comments right here and I'll submit it. So that's how that looks, okay? It's pretty cool. Now, choose response destination. I want them to go automatically to a new spreadsheet. It's going to be called Excel VBA is fun. Questions and responses is really what this sheet is. You can make a new sheet if you want. Um, yeah, so hit create. And I have now created that form. And please take a moment to fill out. It'll take you about 25 seconds. And I would certainly appreciate it. It would help you because whatever you say there, I will start shooting towards. And it will help me because obviously I want to tailor towards your needs and not just make a random video that doesn't help anybody. Thanks for watching, guys. We'll get more into some Google Drive, Google Doc things. I have found some amazing things that you can do with a stock portfolio that will drive your employer or uh, yourself wild because these are very helpful things you can do with the Google spreadsheets amazing stuff stuff that you cannot do in Excel um, not as well anyway thanks for watching guys